Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at the application of maximum likelihood estimation to exponential distribution. That is, given the probability density function of an exponential variable is f of xn is equal to the probability density of the random variable xn is given by lambda times e power minus lambda xn where lambda is the parameter of the density function. So, so given n observations x that is x is equal to xn where n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 that is n observations are given now the goal is to estimate the parameter lambda of the exponential distribution so so for this purpose let us define the log likelihood function that is the log likelihood is given by l of x the parameter lambda is equal to the summation of logarithm of the density function f of x n with n values from 0 to n minus 1. Here we are assuming that the observations x n or the values x n are independent of each other that is these random values x 1, x 2, x 3, x 4, x 5 and so on are all independent of each other. So, the log likelihood function is given by this summation this summation so now we can find the unknown parameter lambda by simply maximizing this function that is lambda hat is given by maximization of this log likelihood function with respect to lambda so this can be achieved by making the derivative that is partial derivative of this log likelihood function with respect to lambda equal to 0. So, by solving this equation, we can determine the uh, or we can estimate the unknown value lambda. So, first we have to derive the expression for log likelihood function. So, for that we need to have expression of logarithm of f of x n that is logarithm of the probability density function that is logarithm of lambda e power minus lambda x n which is basically equal to logarithm of lambda minus lambda x. Therefore, the log likelihood function is given by summation of this expression that is summation means n times logarithm of lambda because it is a constant and then we have minus lambda times summation n is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x. Therefore, this is the log likelihood function. Now, we can equate its derivative that is derivative of this log likelihood function to 0 that is the derivative of this expression is given by n by lambda minus summation n is equal to 0 to 0 to n minus 1 x n is equal to 0 therefore clearly the solution is given by lambda hat is equal to 1 by 1 by n summation over n x n that is the estimate of the parameter lambda of an exponential distribution is given by the value 1 by the arithmetic average of the observation that is lambda hat is equal to 1 by x bar that is the arithmetic average of the observation no, now note that for an exponential distribution the mean value the mean value is given by lambda inverse so, so from this estimate can clearly see that the estimate of lambda inverse is equal to x bar that is the estimate of the mean of the exponential distribution is given by the given by the arithmetic average of the observations which is clearly expected therefore the estimate of the inverse of the parameter lambda is equal to the mean value or the arithmetic average of the observations and estimate of the parameter itself is given by the inverse of the arithmetic mean of the observations. Thanks for watching.